Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome to uh, <clears throat> Oblivion. Um, I'll just jump right in, I guess. This game is bad to launch. Bethany Esda has almost defeated me again. I literally almost gave up on this LP because of how bad this game is to launch. I was born 87 years ago. For 65 years, I've ruled as Tamriel's emperor. But for all these years, I've never been the ruler of my own dreams. I have seen the gates of oblivion, beyond which no waking eye may see. Behold, in darkness, a doom sweeps the land. This is the 27th of Last Seed, the year of Akatosh 433. These are the closing days of the Third Era, and the final hours of my life. <laughs> so, uh, hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome to the Elder Scrolls IV. Oblivion. Uh, if you don't know me, I did a, I've done like 60 videos on Warwind. And so now I guess I'm going to do that in Oblivion, probably. Um, here's a real bombshell to drop, though. I have never played Oblivion before. I've done more than one playthrough, full playthrough of um, Morrowind. And I've done like... No, I've done like I've done like at least five playthroughs of Skyrim. I know I've done less of that than Morrowind. But I've never played uh Ugh. The hair's kind of shiny at least, but the face is bad. Ugh. Just the two. <laughs> Sorry, it's serious. This is a real game. Oh, God. <laughs> Rogarthian. Rothgarian. Sorry. What's... Come on, Todd. <laughs> Where's my guys? Ugh. Ugh. Oh, that's good at least. Oiled. <laughs> Seen that before, I think. High style. That one's silly. God. Rogue knot, thinning, military. They even give you a little bandani. Natural. I don't know if I would describe it like that. Loose, gathered. Ponitale, tall knot. Tonsure, cropped. We're back to windswept. What is with the bald spot, though? That's weird. Charcoal, black, bright blonde, rose blonde. Oh, we can just make our own as well. Here. Sorry, I'm doing a bit. It's making me laugh. Here. 
fragile specimen, the Isle of Red Zane. But Hawk, he spots a predator. And he goes into attack mode. God. Why is it bald with, with a mohawk on top of it? I don't feel like those should be coexisting. Okay, well, that's a lot better. <laughs> this is me when I sniff bleach by accident. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Turn that back. Can we... Maybe that... Windbound isn't bad. Maybe a little more. That's kind of nice. Oiled. The the giant, huge, like, hair hats are stupid. I kind of like loose. That's what my hair is doing right now. Ponytail's okay. I like the way that the ears poke through. I don't know if that's intentional. That might just be a clipping thing. Todd. The Widow's Peak is so crazy here. Like, this goes all the way back onto their head. You couldn't do that unless you were, like, balding. Oh, shit. What are we going to name ourselves? Well. Hmm. See, I usually play a lot of my Morrowind, or my, I guess, like, RPGs, like, pretty, like, honest. Like, I even do a little bit of role-playing. Or, like, I'll let uh, a role-play decide my decision. I've already decided that I'm not going to make this, like, a direct sequel to my Morrowind LP. Like, I'm not just going to be like, oh, this is the, this is the Nereverian again. I myself don't need that. Oh, we can do more. Okay, cool. Salian? I feel like a more gaunt face is better. Uh heads don't work this way Todd skulls do not work that way you can't just this is terrible I've been playing around here for five minutes this isn't how faces work Oh, boy. I kind of like that. Yeah, big chin. Okay. Eyes then, huh? Ugh. You can't do this, Todd. This isn't right. I feel like I've ruined this character now. Jaw. The chin is crazy. <laughs> Lips inflated versus deflated. <laughs> uh. 
Oh man, this is terrible. How do they make character creator this bad? I'll leave the nose where it is. Let's try to fix the chin a little bit. That's fine. I'll <laughs> I need a helmet stat though. Oh, this is all going in. I'm not cutting a second of this. I kind of like, yeah, I like this. Maybe we can lighten that a little bit. Take that down. Okay. See, Skyrim gives you the war paint option, and that's pretty great. Why does why did the eyebrows change the entire face, Todd? That's not right. That isn't right. Okay, that's like real. Nasolabial lines, huh? For when you sniff crack. I don't want to hit random. Oh, man. Okay, we got to think of something. I'm I'm casting around in my room looking for help divine aid Kar Karak Puran Oh, God, you can't be serious. Okay. Well, the walk speed is pretty bad. What? The walk speed is pretty bad, but... That's wrong. That's just straight up wrong. How could E be jump and... How could EB jump and uh, space be pick up? Now, can we get some? Good, thank you. Can we get some subtitles? Oh, this game is so old it actually doesn't recognize my graphics card. Here, thank you. Thank you. You got your wife back home? Tell you what, I'm getting up in a couple of hours. When I get back tomorrow morning, I'll look for her. She must be so lonely. Don't you worry. Man, I'm killing you second one. It's a fairly, like... Unusual start, I would say, to an Elder Scrolls. Like, I know that you have to start as a prisoner no matter what. God. So let's talk about this, huh? What's this prisoner doing here? This cell is supposed to be off limits. Oh, this cell. Uh... Usual mix up with the watch. I. Never mind. Get that gate open. Stand back, prisoner. We won't hesitate to kill you if you get in our way. You, prisoner, stand aside. Over by the window. Stay out of the way and you won't get hurt. 
I'm frozen in place now. No sign Stay put, prisoner. Good. Let's go. We're not out of this yet. You. I've seen you. Let me see your face. You are the one from my dreams. Then the stars were right. And this is the day. Gods give me strength. Uh, so let's talk about this for a sec. This is Patrick Stewart. Um, I think, right? Let me check that. Yeah. I can't believe how ugly this fucking character is. Like, maybe it's just the hair, but like, why in the name of God would they give a character played by Patrick Stewart hair? And it's so ugly of hair, too. Um, but so they gave Patrick Stewart... Never mind, let's just play. Assassins attacked my sons, and I am next. My blades are leading me out of the city along a secret escape route. By chance, the entrance to that escape route leads through your cell. Why am I in jail? Perhaps the gods have placed you here so that we may meet. As for what you have done, it does not matter. That is not what you will be remembered for. <laughs> Bethesda says don't worry about it. I am your emperor, Uriel Septim. By the grace of the gods, I serve Tamriel as her ruler. You are a citizen of Tamriel, and you too shall serve her in your own way. What should I do? You will find your own path. Take care. There will be blood and death before the end. Please, sire, we must keep moving. Better not close this one. There's no way to open it from the other side. Looks like this is your lucky day. Just stay out of our way. Oh, yeah. Don't try anything. I'm watching you. So Bethesda and their classic mismanagement of money uh, are rather well known for casting Liam Neeson to play a character in Fallout 3. Uh, the character has maybe like... 15 continuous minutes Don't of screen time. Close up left. Protect the Emperor. Protect the yourself. Down. This is only the beginning. Worse is yet to come. Sure. I forget exactly how much it is, but there's not a great deal of stuff that you get in. Um... Are you all right, sire? Cool assassins. She's dead. Steel short sword. Can't take his clothes. Damn. Well, let's gear up, shall we? Could they be waiting for us here? Unless I just can't do that yet. Don't know, but it's too late to go back now. Don't worry, son. We will get you out of here. They won't be the first to underestimate the blades. There's trouble I'll take head. point. Let's move. You stay here, prisoner. Don't try to follow us. F is to draw them. Ah. <laughs> oh yeah, rat meat. I'm calling this an episode zero because I don't want to, like, bog people down with all the dumb stuff I'm doing in character creation. Fist icon. There we go. Damn, my character's ripped. Put that on at least. This guy's pretty kitted out too. Yoink. 
If you have a lock pick, you can reach into most locks. Pick most locks. Move upward into a tumbler. When it reaches the top of the lock, click the, click it to secure it. What? Weird. Use a bow, have the bow. The bucket near the wall will make a good target. Cool. Yeah, I know that some people just find the tutorial of Oblivion like horrendously boring. Hey, they have the same kind of, uh... What are you, then? A goblin shaman? Like an unironic goblin? Uh, I can't right-hand that. Oh, C for spells. Okay. Well, I don't know what that does, but I hope it's something good. This is weird. Damn. All kinds of goodies. Oh, here we go. Heal minor wounds and flare. And of course, I got my ancestral guardian with me. The axe is blunt? Okay. Rusty iron crates. Yes, bitch. Slay. Can I have that on? Cool. This axe is huge. I feel like that's always a problem in, um... Oh, it just, you hit it and it just goes. Okay, that's fine. Magic is low and you may not be able to cast spells. I have played a video game before. I do know what magic is. You call it the semi-silly phrase magica, but I assure you I can figure it out. Damn. This isn't bad, actually. Like, the actual feel is pretty good. Oh, and I am also draining stamina. Mort flesh. It's called straight up and down zombie. Cool. So... Normally I would have something pithy or clever or something like that to say here. Sweet. Um, but like, I'm just like, this is, this is all new to me. This is all new stuff to me. Fatigue is low, can't do as much melee damage. Interesting. This actually has a lot of mechanics that I like really like in it. Like it's obviously a lot uglier than Skyrim. It looks a little better than Morrowind, but Morrowind has a bit of an art style going on. Ooh, an iron shield and lettuce helmets. Wands. Cheese wedge.
I can get rid of uh, some of this junk, huh? What's the... How do I drop something? Hello? Oh, there's a grab button. That's good to know. Oh, man, and I can't walk either. <laughs> well, that ain't good. Okay, I have a favorites list. Oh. No. Oh, we got maps. Quests. Oh, cups is quest. One cup is... Cup without hand is quest. It's weird. I can pick up the skulls. Nice. You love to see it. Okay, for real. How do I drop something? Shift click. Oh, and I'm still full up, huh? So this is one-handed blunt. It's four, eight, one, one hundred. This is this is three, eight, and that's four, twelve. Value, weight, damage. Okay, I'll just drop both then. I'll drop this as well. Let's try this. Too bad I can't dual wield. I actually really like dual wielding. Oh man, we got acrobatic skills as well. So I noticed that I just started playing without actually like putting all my points in something or having a bunch of skills or anything like that. Oh, and we do have a compass as well. That's good. I know a lot of shitheads in the Mora Boomer uh, camp are like, ugh, can't believe this game tells you where to go and how to beat it. Like, look. I played more than enough. Yoink. I played more than enough Morrowind to formulate a very educated opinion on this. Hotkey stuff. Okay. Stink horn. Hand scythe and shovel. Goblin hasn't seen you yet. Notice the crosshairs and eye. So I actually, um, shit click. There we go. This might show my age here, but I actually remember when, um, 
Ooh, we can... That's okay. I want better gloves. We get a good shield as well. Yeah, there we go. You also put those on? Those are silly looking. Let's go back to these. Yeah, fashionable. Look at me. I'm a level one character in an RPG. My health isn't that low, is it? Cool, he had lockpicks. Potion of illness. Mortar and pestle. So if I get the chance to put points, because like in Skyrim you don't put points in anything, and I actually don't know um Okay. Maybe I understand that. Let's put a torch on just to see how that looks. This is interesting. I'm actually kind of excited about this. It's been a while since I played a uh Oh, you swap. Okay, that that makes a lot of sense, actually. I will say, the fighting animation is just a little... <laughs> Rather silly, I will say. Yeah, there's actually a lot of control stuff here that makes this game, like, pretty decent to play as it goes, you know? A regular iron dagger instead of a rusty one? Sweet. So it's... It's just a straight upgrade. Okay, cool. But that's still better. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot more, like, mini-game to that now. Let's see if there's something I can drop out of here. Uh, I'll drop this, just because, like, it's, it's not that good of a shield. Uh, and let's, um, so fatigue. Okay, this is health. Wow, okay, so I actually don't have that much health. Cool. Haha, -ha, you fools. But because I didn't deal damage using my own skills, I don't get the XP for that. It's like a relatively realistic way of picking locks. Relatively. So how about this then, huh? Combine ingredients. Oh, we can just go. What do we know about this? Restore fatigue. Restore fatigue. Create. Cool. And these are damage fatigues. Okay. Cool. So what about this? Okay, yeah, so we can poison it. Yeah, because I think I remember you couldn't actually, like, do that in, um... Oops, wrong button. I'll drop one. And then I want to put my hat back on, thank you. You couldn't actually poison... Cool. Um, weapons in Morrowind. Discovered a note from both here at the Arcane University. If I can recover the Dwarven artifacts that have gone missing, there may be a reward. What? Is that a bug? Or did I pick something up without realizing it? How do you feel about that, huh? Knife. Or 
Right, right. So let's see if we can burn through some of this. Oh, it doesn't let you create it if there's like nothing, huh? Well, what if we put three in? Oh. Neat. take nine pounds out huh yeah this is like oh damn it's actually like a very competent game I just I, I never got around to playing it after all these years you know and it's, it's not cuz like I just didn't like it or anything it's just like you can play that game Fucking wizard's duel. Um, rusty iron mace. Ooh, soul gem and ruby. Shway. Uh, I want to talk about my choice. Um, obviously Dunmer are the uh, tour de jour in Morrowind. They're the most common race. Damn. Oh, we still got repair hammers too. Nice. And a repair hammer. I actually don't like the fact that there's no repair skill or uh, weapon durability in Skyrim as well. I feel like it's a bit much in Morrowind. Um, and at some point, it just it's just a chore. Like, it's just not fun. But there is a little bit where, like, it's cool, you know? Oh, we can buy houses too. Dang. Crazy. Alright, so yeah. I think that was all of them. It's that prisoner again. Kill him. He might be working with the assassins. No, he is not one of them. He can help us. He must. I they cannot God. understand why I trust you. They've not seen what I've seen. How can What's I explain? What's up with your eyes? Listen, you know the Nine. How they guide our fates with an invisible hand. I'm not on good terms with the gods. I've served the Nine all my days, and I chart my course by the cycles of the heavens. The skies are marked with numberless sparks, each a fire, and every one. Oh, is sign. this where I get to pick my sign? I know these stars well, and I wonder which sign marked your birth. Yeah, bingo. Okay. So I was hoping that I would get to do all of this earlier. But um, this is why this is episode zero, because I, I, I will just get stuck in and go through these granular. 100 point bonus gives you way more weakness to magic. So is that pure magic, like just magic damage, like blue damage, or is it anything magical? Lady, willpower and endurance. That was really useful in... um. That was really useful in, in Morrowind. That's, I think, the best sign to go with. Just straight more. Ability speed, uh, agility speed and luck. You don't regen magicka. You get spell absorption. You get more magicka. The Lord. Uh, I already have a... That's interesting. But I already have a um, resistance to fire. The Lover. Burn your fatigue and paralyze someone for 10 seconds. The Ritual. Get a really awesome restore health. The Serpent. The Shadow. The Steed. The Tower. That's just the unlocking. And the Warrior. Hmm. I can't change these later, can I? 
the thing about Autronok is that like Autronok's kind of fun, you know? Like having to get hit by by magical uh, attacks in order to use your own magic is interesting. Hmm. And of course, like the difference between these will be made up in the long run later. I don't know. Maybe I'll go with Achanok. Yes. The signs I read show the end of my path. My death, a necessary end, will come when it will come. I was kind of hoping that he would have a, a line based on, oh, of course, the Autronach, there's a bro and under the sign. Of, they are very, very good at getting caught on fire. Your stars are not mine. Today, oh, well, he does. Shall I'm glad. With your appointed burden. Aren't you afraid? The trophies of my triumphs precede me, but I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood. They know their doom, but not the hour. But I'm a murder, though, so... I am blessed to see the hour of my death. To face my apportioned fate... Apportioned. Interesting choice of word, but I like it. Can you see my, my fate? My dreams grant me no opinions. Pardon? Doors of death. But in your face, I behold the sun's companion... The dawn of Akatosh's bright glory oh, may vanish that, huh? the coming darkness. With such hope, and with the promise of your aid, my heart must be satisfied. Where are we going? I go to my grave. A tongue shriller than all the music calls me. Hmm. You shall follow me yet for a while. Then we must part. You shall complete the tutorial, and then we shall You part. may as well make yourself useful. Carry that torch and stick close. Baurus. We're the Emperor's ba Although I admit. I know what the blades are. My job is to make sure the Sure thing. Stick close and let us do our job. So what's behind us then? Okay. Yeah, that probably just leads like straight back, huh? Did you have any goodies? No. Well, that's unfortunate. See, I usually really like having uh, a, a good bevy and op, uh, a good bevy of options. They have like summon, summon armor. That's cool. Why is this built like this? What are you guys got assassins? Probably nest under the eaves like woodpeckers, you know? I feel like the Emperor is a little gung-ho here about like running like dick first into danger. The Emperor's been in danger, man. Ooh, goodies. I'll get rid of these. Yeah, I don't want my, like... I don't really want to have my shapeless sackcloth shirt. It's not exactly flattering. I, I, I live to be cool. I was going to say I play RPGs to be cool, but, like, it's not that simple. I live to either be cool or comfortable. So, like... like this. Let me take a look. Even the shirt I'm wearing now, like, it's got, like, a cool bird and some other, like, miscellaneous edgy stuff on it. And I like that. I think that's cool and fun. Oh, I can train my thing. Here, minor wounds. Come with us. Um, so obviously, yeah, Dunmer are the, like generic class in Morrowind. If you're not picking a class, then you're picking or not picking a race, then you're picking Dunmer. The gate is fought from the other side. The trap. What about that side passage back there? Worth a try. Let's go. 
<laughs> it's kind of interesting that like w uh, magic is just a button you hit. I know that's kind of how it was in um. It's a dead end. Morrowind, but like I do like I the know. the Skyrim thing of like it's like essentially ground. just a sword that you hold. Like magic is just one of those. Wait here with the Emperor. Guard him with your life. For for the the Emperor. Emperor. I'm not getting paid for this. Why don't you guys guard him with your life? I can go no further. You alone must stand against the Prince of Destruction and his. Oh, he took off his thing. Probably because he he's not have talking about how he must not have the Amulet of Kings. Take the amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Not Joffrey, oh no. Find him and close shut the jaws of oblivion. <laughs> okay, we can talk about it now. We failed. I've... The amulet. Where's... Strange. They say it's the dragon blood that flows through the veins of every. They see more than lesser the men, huh? Of kings is a so yeah, let's talk about that. Most people in preparation for this role, crown, but that's just jewelry. The man himself, Patrick the Stewart, was given a. I think it's like a hundred-page document the detailing the lore of the Elder Scrolls, describing what happens in Arena, in what? Daggerfall, and Morrowind, and in the stuff besides. I must take it to Joffrey. Joffrey. He said that. Why? It's another heir. Nothing I ever heard about. Oh, uh, someone's sowing their wild oats. He's the grand Could Paddy Stu not keep his dick in his pants? Although you may not think so to meet him, he lives quietly as a monk at Wainan Priory, near the city of Coral. How do I get there? First, you need to get out of here. Through that door must be the entrance to the sewers, past the locked gate. It's a secret way out of the Imperial City. Or it was supposed to be secret. I kind of like this helmet you're wearing. For the last it's a semi-realistic helmet. It's actually pretty realistic. A little gaudy, a little ugly, but there are probably gets the job done. Down there. But from what I've seen of you, experienced scout. Oh, he guesses your thing, and then you can be like, "Well, actually." Um. All right. Let me finish my two thoughts. I like playing Dunmer because not just because they're the Morrowind race, but also because Dunmer have a lot of points in everything, while they have a little amount of points in every skill. So playing a Dunmer, you end up as a very, very balanced character just from the get go. And that's often how I like to play WRPGs, especially games like this. Acrobat. Just so good of a thief that you can't even fight that good. Agent. Man, there's a lot of these. Um, Stealth Archer, I'm guessing. And you even get Mercantile Illusion Speechcraft. Interesting. Uh, Archer. So like a more up and down war archer. I love this armor. I wish I could get that. This art is cooler than anything I've seen so far. Assassin. Uh, like a more warlike stealth archer. Barbarian. That's my wife. Okay. Bard. Personality intelligence. Big talking. Battle mage. I like battle mages. Um, as mentioned, like being a Dunmer, I have a propensity to err on the side of magic and combat. Like magic and martial combat. Crusader, Restoration and Blade and Blunt, Healer, Knight, love all that. This art is, again, amazing. Like, that, this dude is more handsome than anything you could ever make in the character creator. That art is awesome. That's such a good art. Mage, Monk, Nightblade, Pilgrim, Rouge, Scout, Sorcerer. How is this different from a mage? Oh, you get heavy armor. Weird. Spell sword. Again, I also do like spell sword. Thief. Warrior. And a witch hunter. I will create a custom class. Um, alchemy. I don't see enchanting in here. I think I'll go with magic as the focus. I do like having these. Total magic and magic use. Alchemy, conjuration, mysticism. 
destruction, alteration, and restoration. Effect on everything you do. Luck was actually a pretty good pick in Morrowind, so maybe... Lucky. Seven major skills. Okay. I get seven of these. I'm interested in alchemy. Uh, is there only one blade skill? Because bingo. Armor. So it looks like they've put repair and armory into the same. Or I guess that's just the thing. Security. These will just be useful for me. Mysticism. Okay, so mysticism is still here. So they took that out after Oblivion and in Skyrim. Destruction. How many is that? One, two, three, four, five. Restoration's a good pick. Might be good to pick an armor class. Hmm. See, one thing that happened in my Morrowind playthrough is because I went so, like, physical, I ended up not having a lot of um, opportunities to craft, and so I missed out on a lot of the stuff there. But it looks like I'm only really seeing... Um, You get the idea. Really? I would never have guessed. I like you, Boros. Thank you. You must get the amulet to Joffrey. Take no chances, but proceed to Wayne and Priory immediately. Got it? Yes, I understand. Good. The emperor. What will you do? I'll stay here to guard the emperor's body and make sure no one follows you. You better. Cool. Centuries ago. What is this? Horse armor. No. Oh, are these DLC things that are just coming into my pocket? Fuck that. <laughs> Ain't that a bitch. So yeah, they gave Patrick Stewart a like 100 page thing. Shut up. A 100 page. God. On the lore of this game. Patrick Stewart does the int the intro and then is killed after like 2 minutes worth of his dialogue. And, like, is Bethesda just... Do they just hate having, like, career actors in their games? Like, I think that it is cool that, like, yes, they went out of their way to get Patty Sue. Oh, I get these now. So I have to close to melee range for this, huh? Ooh, wow. Damn. Silver nut and guard. Damn, hell yeah. But yeah, it's just like... It's one of those things... They put... I don't know how much money they could have put into getting Patrick Stewart. But it might have been more than getting... Assuming they didn't pay him by the word. It might have been... I really like the way that they spat... Oh, yeah, yeah, Bethany. You'll never escape ragdolling. Secret. I don't know what the fuck their deal is. They get these, like, million-dollar voice actors. 
and then kill them in pretty short order, I would say. It's a relatively clean sewer. I wouldn't even mind living down here for a bit, you know? Actually, this hole fills me with a little bit of dread now that I mention it. Wait, is this the... <laughs> oh, yeah. Nothing but rats, baby. I'm good, dude. Oh, armor protection goes down with the debuff. Wow. So we in here. Way in priory. Wow. This is a fucking video game I'm playing. Now, maybe I'm an insane person here, but might it be nice if video games still looked like this, you know? Like, maybe that might be a little silly, I'm sure. Ugh, why do they write it like that? But yeah, it might be a little silly. Like, there's no reason that game should look this ugly. But the thing is, like, this game looks decently fine. Like, if it had a little sharper of textures, maybe a little better optimization, then, like, it wouldn't even be that bad, you know? Like, so many games are just trying to push their envelope or, or just be, like, the new hottest thing. And, like, no one cares anymore. Like, after Crisis 2... I don't think I've seen anyone mark out over graphics since Crisis 2. Like, because it's either as good as or not as good as Crisis 2. I've not seen anyone match that, even since. And, like, now that we're post-Crisis 2 and, like, we are matching it, like, it's not that big of a deal. Because, like, well, of course things look like Crisis 2 now. Look better than... Look like or better than Crisis 2 now. Because... Because, you know, it's the future we're living in. Man, Crisis 2 was 10 years ago. And you get all the PS1 demakes. Like, the Bloodborne uh, demake just came out. And, like, I think someone's working on a Dead Space 1 demake. By the way, I have a running LP of Dead Space that updates infrequently that you should definitely watch because it's awesome. My wife sent in. She does a very good job. Man. One of the things about this is that, like, on the one hand, I'm excited to be in um, a new Elder Scroll. And, like, I know that this is a fucking 15-year-old game now. Older, maybe. Does this hurt me? Ooh, it does. I can use that. The market city of the Imperial District. <laughs> wow. Presumed male in Colovian. Oh, like the origin of the fur helmet. Have my ear, citizen. You are an ugly man. Yeah, I'm level one in an RPG. I'm wearing rusted iron and, and leather. Nothing I'd like to talk about. Please be generous, kind sir. Anyone looking for work should. Ah, uh, that's enough idea. We've got statues. Black horse courier. Good as new merchandise. 
Feel free to browse, friend. It's nice. May I interest you in some of my Haka fine Viren. wares? Whoa! The money is huge, but look at that. It's two-handed blade. It does six damage, I think. But it damages your health 15 points. It damages your health, your 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 magic and your stamina 30. Holy shit. We got some amulets. Cloth. I don't know if that'll do me any good, but. Well, let me see if I can't. Whoa, how does okay, how does this work? Fair Quick save. Well. Feel free. I'll buy How did you Okay, it doesn't go that huge. Interesting. That's kind of weird. Okay, cool. And get some better money now. Okay, take that out of my pocket. You need to make a better offer. I can't afford. Oh, it's what she'll accept. Make me a better offer. You drive a You drive a hard bargain. Drive a hard I'm I'm not even making 50% of what I'm giving you here, dude. Quit displaying Elden Ring in case anyone wanted to know. You got a great deal there. I don't really need the dagger. The sword is fine. I'll keep the axe on me just cuz I want to have the options. Thank you. Fare thee Word. Well. Hourglass. Or rake shovel. Somebody help! Come quickly! I don't like the way you're purposefully walking to me, sir. Don't be the last to read today's Black Horse Courier. I don't like that. <laughs> oh, God. Why do they gotta walk so scary? Wow. Oh! Is that one of the towers? Okay, I think we're good. The towers are a, a concept in, for those who don't know, the towers are a concept in Elder Scrolls uh, that are like places where reality like connects to itself. If you need to learn how to use They're like anchor points to the whole world. Oh yeah, there's a working arena in this game as well. Oh look, there's lily pads and stuff. How they even drew the stems? Almost nobody draws the stems on lily pads. Not even Minecraft does, and Minecraft has pretty slavish attention to detail. Statue of Akatosh, I imagine. Often depicted as a dragon. Can I click on it and get a blessing of him? Wait, what's this man's name? No Coins Dranius. No Coins.
Stop! You violated the law. That's too... Okay. Here's the procedure. Oh my god, that's such a waste of time. I didn't even take anything. I literally just... touched it with my palm. Goodness. I still got one. Yeah, I do. Cool. Actually, I'll cross using the bridge. Might be a little safer. Uh, so yeah, the towers. The towers are a concept in Elder Scrolls that like, wow. Sorry. Towers are a concept in Elder Scrolls uh, where like, they're where reality can like reconnect to itself. It's kind of a weird way to put it, but yeah, that's basically the gist. Um, they're anchor points of... of space and time and if you destroy them uh time becomes unwound uh and so does space because those are actually the same thing that's a that's real world lore that's not just elder scrolls as well um and if you could control them then you could uh you know stranger there comes a time in every man who did I lose to? Bunch of damn fish. Ah. Yeah, well, I'm not a hero. A villain or something. Way in Priory, your troll. I'm gonna play until I reach Joffrey. So, welcome to the Warnet Inn. Everyone's talking about the assassination. Oh, cool. Have a fine journey and keep yourself safe. Red hand means stealing. Makes sense. See, to me, red hand means child soldiers. Oh, we can check these now. Choral. Bruma. Chadenal. Bravil. Eowyn, Envil, Kvach, Skingrad. I don't like the sound of Skingrad. I don't like the sound of the place one bit. So the Dwemer, um, which are Sky uh, Skyrim and the Elder Scrolls, like, loose equivalent to dwarves, built a... Where's my red thing I'm following? Uh, they turned the... I think the... It might have been called the Ebony Tower... Or the Red Tower. But anyway, the Red Mountain, the, the big mountain in um, Morrowind is a tower. But my table, sorry. Uh, and the reason is because of a great source of power at its core. And they actually turned that thing into a tower as well. It's called the Brass Tower. And it's actually a giant mech made out of the Dwemer uh, metal. Oh my gosh, a deer. Radical. Immersive. <laughs> Enemies nearby, you say? Is it you? Yeah, they have this giant, like, mech that can be piloted. And it's actually, like, equivalent in power to a god. And because of all the weird, like, reality warping things that the Elder Scrolls gods can do. Uh, the fact that, like, a mortal... Like, several mortals, of course, but, like, a mortal, like, built that is kind of crazy. And means a lot. 
Why would anyone want to play Kingdom Come Deliverance when you have Oblivion? This isn't a joke. I hate Kingdom Come Deliverance. Yeah. Just gotta lead your shots. Do I have potions to drink? Store fatigue. This guy's a master. This guy's a pro. Yes. Not worth it one bit. You know what? I had fun. My next thing that I want to get is a spell that restores my stamina. Wow. Big ass trees. You know, I've now played so much that I feel like I can't call this episode zero. Because my plan was that the tutorial and this would be episode zero. But, like, I actually did more than I expected. I, I kind of also thought that I would spend way more time in character creation. And I ended up not doing that. I might want to get back on the path. St. Jan's Wart Nectar. Sounds like one of those products that your dad has. And, like, you never see him buy any. You never know where they come from. You don't know where to buy some yourself. But he just always has some. Like, I don't know where the fuck one gets Burt Bees. I don't even know if I if I can remember seeing it being sold. But, like, I know that my dad will always have some. That's kind of cool. Anybody in here? Reading the history of my girl Berenzia. Got some corn. What was that? A repair hammer. Horse linens. Another hammer. Whoa, sweet. Tang I really thought that I was Sujama. I'm a little disappointed now. Nern root. Ah, uh, you're kidding. I haven't seen a person in a while. Really thought that there would be someone in there. I was hoping to wet my blade. This looks vaguely like a uh, church, right? Awesome. Cool. Um, I feel good about this. I'm having a lot of fun. But, um, I've been Alfred. This has been Oblivion. I'm playing in Elder Scrolls again. I'm happy about that, too. But yeah, I've been Alfred. Uh, I'm having a good time. I'll see you guys later. Bye.